what is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here so we're talking about joker 2 in this video here today and i guess i can just call it the official title because we got two things one happened yesterday with the release date and details about where the movie will mostly be taking place at potentially coming from the rap and then today we got a cast announcement that confirmed joaquin phoenix will be back as arthur fleck the joker and that lady gaga will indeed be joining him as harley quinn so joker finally i do is expected to be out in theaters on october 4th of 2024 and the the subtitle translates into shared madness there's already been these wild theories out there that maybe there's going to be two jokers in it and i know that was also kind of like borrowing from an idea that william willem dafoe brought up earlier in the year about what he would do with a sequel to the joker or how he would approach it anyway and now considering these details about where the movie could potentially be set at again coming to us courtesy of the rap i think that they are doing a i think it was called mad love the, that storyline between harley quinn and the joker where she was basically his psychiatrist they of course met in arkham asylum which is where it's a reportedly supposed to be taking place primarily uh and then they fell in love or she fell in love with him and she ends up helping him escape because it says according to an insider with knowledge of the project a lot of the joker sequel takes place inside arkham asylum it's not saying how heavily how how the how the location necessarily plays into the movie heavily other than that a lot of it takes place inside of arkham asylum so what i'm assuming is that they are doing a mad love storyline where arthur fleck who we know ended up being kept at arkham asylum it seemed like at the end of the 2019 film will get a new psychiatrist because at the end it was a, it was uh presumed that he killed the one that was in the room with him when he was laughing about something she asked what was so funny he said you wouldn't get it and then we we are shown him walking out of the room leaving bloody footprints and then uh orderlies are chasing him around as the movie cuts off so I'm assuming this will be his new uh, therapist or psychiatrist, someone named whatever her name will be. I can't I can't even think of what Harley Quinn's original name was. So it'll be Harley Quinn that he meets and then she will fall in love with him and he will corrupt her, uh, make him or help him escape due to the corruption and manipulation that she undergoes. And that's how that will play out. Lady Gaga confirmed her participation in the movie courtesy of a tweet which was showing us like our first official teaser I guess you could say for the movie which had her dancing and it had Joaquin Phoenix dancing as Harley Quinn and the Joker with the release date plastered over it uh, for October 4th of 2024 so I am looking forward to this movie I am looking forward to seeing Arkham Asylum become a factor in the narrative much more than it was just at the end of the original movie so if it ends up taking place primarily in arkham asylum then that tells me they're they are going to go in that route of telling that love story between these two and how this corrupt man corrupted this therapist at this asylum and made made her become an accomplice and assist him in his efforts to escape so this could be another great chance to do a character study again taking a little bit off of joker and placing it more on the therapist he's corrupting harley quinn and seeing what lady gaga can bring to the table in this role some people are again on the fence about her being cast as uh, harley quinn because everyone can only think about margot robbie who does a tremendous job as her her iteration of harley quinn but i think lady gaga can still do something quite incredible with the character as well and i think there's a chance for us to see some great chemistry on screen with her and joaquin phoenix so the other aspect of this movie that i know many people are on the fence about i don't really have i don't really know where this could end up factoring in at this point i have an idea in my mind because they didn't they didn't specify this the teaser gave us a glimpse of that's what they're going to do though the musical aspect the movie being a musical if it ends up going in that musical aspect route which it again seems like it is doing where does the musical aspect come in what i'm thinking of in my mind at this point is a movie in which harley quinn is imagining herself over time throughout the movie during these different sessions she has with arthur and falling falling more in love with him with each new session she starts to then imagine herself with him outside of the asylum 
and she's just singing in these montages that occur in her head that's how you can factor in the musical element they don't necessarily have to make it a full-fledged musical where it's like Grease or In the Heights or any of these other musical films that are well known they don't have to do anything like that it could very much just be something that's occurring in Harley Quinn's head where she imagines life with Joker and she just imagined these things with musical numbers and that could be how they factor it in or if they decide to make it where they they are running around the asylum singing and dancing that's fine too it all just comes down to how it's depicted on screen we basically have a lot of dance sequences not a lot but one iconic stairwell dance sequence i would say in the original joker film so i would love to see some more of that incorporated into the sequel and then tossing in lady gaga you know who already has a tremendous voice she just put out one of the best songs i've heard from her in recent memory with that uh top gun 2 soundtrack song i think it was called hold my hand a beautiful song so i can't wait to see how she brings the character of harley quinn to life what her iteration on the character will look like and i can't wait to see how they explore this dynamic between harley quinn and joker assuming that's the route they're going to take telling us the mad love storyline in which harley quinn is arthur flex therapist and over time with each new session that she has with the man she becomes more corrupted becomes more invested in this these insane topics he brings up and he's just manipulating her to get on his side and ultimately they escape that could breathe into a trilogy closer for joker 3 if you want to take that route and they could be running amok all around the city and again, there are, there are already people I know that don't even think this sequel that we're getting is necessary. I can understand where you're coming from. I'm not saying it's necessarily necessary to have a Joker sequel, but it's something that I know many people also want to see. Only because of the fact that that first one does have a does have an audience and a fan base and it did so well i think it made over a billion dollars so i'm not surprised at go going off of the business aspect because that's primarily what will draw in a sequel discussion from that standpoint i'm not shocked we got a sequel and i do think this sequel will end up being one of the more favorable sequels of uh, that come out in 2024 and one of the more favorable sequels for me generally out of many sequels i've seen in my life i just have a feeling about this movie that it's going to be something special and i think if even if it's not i think lady gaga is going to give us something special with her iteration of harley quinn but let me know what you guys think about this down in the comment section below if you haven't already of course make sure you subscribe turn on post notification there is a video in the description i'll have links on social media accounts on facebook twitter and instagram you can message me there of course let me know if there's any movies news or reviews you like me to cover in the future and with all that in mind guys i will see you in the next video